What do you What do you think of Governor McCabe? I wish he would stop. I'm gonna buy me a bicycle. McCabe. Oregon is now the first state in the nation with a voluntary gasoline rationing system. Earlier this week, Oregon Governor Tom McCall met with over 600 service station operators after many dealers had expressed opposition to the initial ration plan proposed by the governor. When the meeting ended, McCall polled the audience. Only a few of the operators stood up against a modified version of the proposed system. Approval was nearly unanimous. Oregon's rationing system works this way. Owners of cars with even-numbered license plate last digits can buy gas on even-numbered dates. Cars with plates having odd-numbered last digits get gas on odd-numbered dates. Priority public service users can get gas any day of the week, as well as out-of-state drivers. To indicate the fuel status at his station, a dealer will fly a flag visible from the street or highway. Red for no gas available, yellow if he is pumping only to priority public service users, and a green flag means anyone can buy gasoline, provided his license number is appropriate for the date. Oregon has custom plates with initials too, and they've been assigned the number zero. Do Oregonians think the plan will work? We ask some dealers and customers. End of the state of Oregon. Harry Weatherford, Salem, Oregon. This is Oregon gas. It's undated. Shot uh, on uh, January 12, 74 in Salem, Oregon. Oregon is now the first state in the nation with a voluntary gasoline rationing system. Earlier this week, Oregon Governor Tom McCall and state officials met with over 600 members of service station operators' organization and dealers themselves. When the meeting ended, McCall polled the audience. Only a few of the dealers stood up against a modified version of the proposed system. The approval was almost unanimous. Oregon's rationing system works this way. Owners of cars bearing license plates ending in even-numbered digits can buy gas on even-numbered dates. Cars with plates having odd-numbered last digits get gas on odd dates. Priority public service users can get gas any day of the week as well as out-of-state drivers. To indicate the fuel status of a particular service station, a dealer will fly a flag visible from the street or highway, red for no gas available, yellow if he is pumping only to priority public service customers, and green flag means that anyone can buy a gasoline provided the license number is appropriate for the date and depending upon the dealer's supply. Oregon has custom plates with initials and names too and they've been assigned zero. Do Oregonians think the plan will work? Okay. What do you think of Oregon's new gas rationing system? Well, I think that it got to the place where they're going to have to do something because of the fact that some people need gas more than others. Now, in my own instance, I, I can find that I can get by uh, on five gallons a week very handily. I walk to work, walk to town, do everything like that. But there are other people who, who absolutely have to have the gas to uh, for their business, and I think that they're the ones who have it. And I think this rationing is a step in the right direction is to share with people that need it rather than the others, and I think there should be a priority system established. Thank you.
How do you think Oregon's new gasoline rationing system will work? Oh, uh, I think so. Work out all right. I think so. Uh, the only thing bad about it is that uh, the gas, the gas, the gas price is too much for me. Fifty cent a gallon. It's going up too much, and I don't like it. I uh, say I'm from back east. I'm from Connecticut, and when I first moved here, it was it wasn't too bad, but now it's getting worse. Thank you very much. How do you think Oregon's new gasoline rationing system will work? Well, I think it'll work good if everybody cooperates, cooperates with it. It's uh, about the only chance we got. I think we follow McCall's plan. I think we'll be all right. It's already eased off. I think people were storing it. Thank you. new gasoline rationing system. What do you think of the gasoline rationing system? Do you think it'll work? Well, we've got to do something. Uh, the way it's been lining up the last couple of weeks, uh, I don't know how long we could last that wait. So I think uh, the plan of uh, from license plate numbers, odd days and even days, and odd license numbers to even license numbers, I think it's, uh, it's got to do some good. It can't hurt us any. OK. What do you think of the gasoline rationing system, ma'am? Well, I think it'll be fine. It'll be, I think it's real easy for everybody to do it this way. OK, thank you very much. Still looking at about a 5.6, Marty. OK. Do you think Oregon's new gasoline system will work, the new gasoline? Oregon's gasoline rationing system has already had some effect. Lines at service stations appear substantially shorter than a week ago, and the Oregon Auto Club reports calls from motorists asking about fuel are down by about 50 percent. Governor Tom McCall says he will support the program by urging Oregon motorists to comply with its regulations, and he is negotiating with the Office of Federal Energy Czar William Simon to ensure a supply of gasoline keeps coming